Hello and welcome. I'm John Peters, Commercial Director for Hooper Enterprise Associates Limited, or Heal Planning as we're better known. This video is a case study detailing a recent planning appeal in the East Suffolk area for a change of use from commercial to residential use that we undertook for a client. Before we start, I'd like to clarify that the client has given us full authority to use this information in this video. This case started for us when we were contacted by our client after an application had been refused by East Suffolk Council and a decision notice was sent to our client refusing the change of use. The client, an experienced developer, had been trying along with their agent to gain the permission, but unfortunately the local authority was not interested in any change of use on that building. This left our client with no alternative but to appeal. The refusal was issued on the 8th of April 2021 and as a change of use had six months to appeal. Our client, however, did not wish to have any further delays and instructed us to proceed the same month. The refusal reasons were mainly overlooking related to adjacent properties and the council were claiming the proposal would cause harm to the living conditions of adjacent properties and would provide a poor standard of amenity to future occupants. As such, would be contrary to the National Planning Policy Framework and East Suffolk Local Planning Policy WLP 8.29. We produced a 16-page appeal statement going through the planning officer's report and the decision notice, providing a comprehensive and robust argument bringing national and local policies into play and detailing reasons why the findings were wrong and how this will not have the adverse effect that the council was stating. Additionally, we compiled a detailed amount of research to find very similar cases that the planning inspector had previously granted and to look how we could use these to benefit this case. The inspector visited the appeal site on the 30th of November and issued the appeal decision on the 14th of December 2021 in a three-page report. The good news was that the appeal was upheld and the permission granted. As always with these types of appeal, attention to detail is absolutely paramount. As an organisation, Hill Planning is one of the leading appeal specialists with both dedicated to in-house planning and legal teams, whose job it is to win your case. Both these skill sets are invaluable to produce a robust, compelling case to gain a possible win. You won't find many organisations in our industry that have both of these skill sets, planning and legal teams, and it is most definitely a major reason why we have the success rate we do. Without appealing your planning refusal, you cannot gain the permission you would like. You'll find a host of videos about various types of planning appeals and the services we offer on our website. Your appeal will go to the Planning Inspectorate. They're a government-based organisation that is appointed by the Secretary of State to handle all types of planning appeals. Based out of Bristol and covering England and Wales, the Planning Inspectorate gives you a chance of success to gain that permission you're seeking and taking the decision process away from your local authority's planning officer. If you'd like a free no obligation consultation with myself or a member of our team, please call us on 01743 369 911 or email appeals at planningappealsuk.com and give your appeal its best chance of success. Thank you for watching and we look forward to speaking with you soon.